Hello everybody, it's Garrett, and today I'm doing a video about the bundle changes coming to Apex Legends. Now, if you've been playing recently, you may have noticed that an Octane bundle came into the store, but there's one issue. You can't buy it if you own Octane as a character. Basically, this acted as a starter pack for people to buy Octane and a skin at the same time. Fortunately, the skin was completely locked off if you owned Octane. Actually, a lot of people instantly complained about this for a while, and even if it was intentional, the devs fixed it just to stop people crying. But then a dev came out with a pretty shocking statement which may kind of mess up some future skin releases uh, and may mess some stuff up down the line. Basically, the main thing that sparked this is someone posted on Reddit, you better not have Octane if you want this Octane stuff, which is some pretty rare Octane skins, and it's not available if you had Octane, but naturally they fixed this. But here's the thing, a dev commented and elaborated on this. They actually did this with a Loba bundle as well. They said it was intentional for a Loba bundle that you weren't allowed to buy this skin if you're on Loba, which people were calling greedy and it's kind of understandable. But they also said this will be continuing in the future. There will be skins and bundles which cannot be bought if you own the base character. So essentially, they're like a starter pack. You buy the character and the skin. It's an incentive for new people to start spending Apex coins on the game. But the thing is, this could happen with any skin at any time. They could literally drop one of the rarest skins ever, which is very high in demand, but people won't be able to buy it because they have to have a core character. It's just a really dumb rule and it's never happened before and it's quite unnecessary and I don't see why they're suddenly bringing it in and kind of pushing it. I know it's to get new people to play the game, but there's no reason to block OG players or people with full characters off from buying this. There's literally no reason, yet they're doing it. There's just no reason. They did say they're watching our feedback, so that's the main reason I'm making this video, to give some feedback. And I want you guys to comment down below what you think, because I honestly don't think this would be healthy for the game. Because imagine if there's a skin you've been waiting for ages, like the Loba swimsuit skin, you have to not own Loba to get it. It's just quite dumb. We need to be vigilant about this and give feedback to the devs. Make sure it's constructive and not rude. And make sure to like this video to get the word out there and also subscribe to my channel for daily apex news make sure to comment down below your thoughts on this and give some criticism to respawn i'll see you soon folks